Hey guys, it's Trigger John coming at you with another Infinite Magic Raid video. Uh, we made a lot of progress on the uh, Free to Succeed account here. Now, let's go ahead and let's cover some of the progress we've made, where we're stuck. What I'm thinking I'm going to do to kind of counteract that uh, stuck stuckness, we'll call it, and how I think moving forward I'm going to be able to kind of rectify some of the things I've seen in my account to make it better while maintaining the free-to-play lifestyle. All right, so first things first, let's go ahead and let's cover what I've accomplished so far in the game. So, so far here, we have went through the world map here and I am on Hell for nine. Nope, Hell for 10. We're on Hell for 10. This is the last one we get to complete and then we'll move into five here. Uh, so that's almost done with the Hells. It looks like this is gonna take me a little bit of time because I'm pretty hard stuck on it. Unfortunately, what I'm noticing is the fact that I only have one A5 Five star hero is killing me. I've got to get um, another DPS. Really, I probably need to take lose all the way up to five out of five to do a lot of damage for me. And then I'll kind of progress a few others. Unfortunately, my two Lego summons yielded me uh, basically nothing, unfortunately, with th those two guys. But it's okay. We'll, uh, we'll I guess we'll overcome that, those difficulties. But the good thing is, I was able to play that a bit and go ahead and get my double legendary, which was very awesome. Now, the other thing I've kind of noticed is I am struggling on food. That seems to be my problem is food, 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 and there's never enough of it. So as you can see here, I, I can't do anything. I have nothing I can craft, unfortunately. Um, even then I've got, uh, what is this? Three out of two that I really need and that's not making fodder. So it's kind of hard to kind of progress with like always constantly needing food. All right, so since I'm always needing food, I'm having to kind of think what methods are available for me to increase the damage that I can do uh, and get around the fact of I can't really progress higher in the awakening tiers, right? So what that's making me do is I'm having to kind of plan a little bit more of what I'm doing. So I first hauled um, Tower of the Mark. I was really focusing on only the Force ones here because my A5 5 star is a Force champion, right? So I thought what better to do and come in here and try to progress these and get these a little further so that way this character would hit harder and maybe by awakening my holder that would be enough and unfortunately that's nowhere near enough and it kind of dawned on me well that's not going to be a very viable strategy because a lot of my dps champions or my other champions i should say are in the red tower right like this this line up here is going to be a lot more sustainable than the other one so that kind of dawned on me well have I spread myself too thin or should I start focusing on how to balance this red team out a little bit to push forward as well to get those permanent stats that way I can at least progress the campaign and get some of those eggs that are in the campaign as a kickback right because I, I'm at the point now where I I really just need to go up in the awakening so I have to figure out what makes the most sense for doing that how do I get the most now I can also do it in a lot of dwarven rounds I have been doing that I've been kind of prioritizing getting these done so that way I can get the gear. Um, I've been running for a lot of leech gear and speed gear, mainly because speed gear I know is something that you will always want in these types of games. I do have it equipped on a couple of my characters. It works well for arena so far. But I am running a lot of the rum dungeon and I'm so close on 21 here, but I still have a long ways, guys. If I'm almost doing 21, I saw 22, 23, 24, 25, and 26 down here. So I still have about five to six more stages to clear to get to that point where I get the guaranteed drops that are decent, right? Because four out of six is terrible because really the only thing that we want on our account is six star gear. Five star gear isn't even all that great, even though I should be accumulating some of it to get the stats that I'm looking for. But I'm getting to the point now where I'm going to try to farm some gear and maybe try to switch our character out of the full leech and maybe into partial leech, partial speed gear. Get her going as fast as humanly possible. As you see here, she's already at 481 speed here, which is pretty quick, but I need to get that crit rate up higher. It's only at 50%, which is low, and crit damage is almost 200%, which is pretty decent from what I understand, but I gotta get that crit rate higher, and I'm not sure how I'm gonna do it yet. Um, I know this one here, uh, this is great. It gives me a lot of crit rate. Uh, unfortunately, I didn't roll any crit damage, anything else impactful here. So it would be kind of nice to get a better one here that has some other stats. But I think in general, what we'll do is we'll try to see if we can't come up with a few of these pieces of gear here. 
um, mainly like this green one and probably the weapon or the accessory, one of the two. Then I can swap out for a speed set of gear with a bunch of crit rate to get me a little bit more consistency, which may allow me to progress further because I got to clear this floor 18. That will give me my egg. And then once I go into the next set of the chapters, that also gives me a couple of more eggs. And then I can start moving forward with some awakenings, which once I get some characters awakening, then I can keep going with progress. Unfortunately, don't make the mistakes I have where I kind of squandered some of my resources and now I'm in a pickle that I'm stuck waiting for days upon days because I can't really move forward until I get those characters awakened. Now, luckily for me, I will be playing the events. Obviously, I see that, you know, coming, coming down the pipe, we have other events that are going to be starting here on Monday. Um, I'm going to hopefully try to complete some of these. I doubt I get them all. But we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to complete some of them to kind of get us a little bit more resources, uh, at least from this way, because it does seem to help. Doing the events is definitely a way to go ahead and maximize your rewards. As you can see here, um, training, we've almost completed this one. I may mess around and grab, upgrade a couple of heroes that I shouldn't to grab this one egg, just because that's how low on the uh on food that i am that even one four star egg would, would be huge for me currently but i am keeping it 100 free to play for you guys so that way that you know the and understand the struggles uh because yeah this is what is this day 11 i think on the account uh day 10 day 10 or 11 on the count for sure um but yeah so we, we've made some progress and we're going to continue to make progress it's not going to just get stuck like as it is uh, so definitely don't worry about that because uh, yeah we've got what is this this is day number um and they said that day, yeah day 10. it's day 10 as of recording right now but um so yeah so definitely keep in mind i will go ahead and then we will keep keeping you updated and yeah leave your comments down below what you guys think what you guys want to see i will probably get going on some spreadsheets here very soon because I got to start doing some ROI on what the energy cost is per gear, per food, for everything. So that way I know it's going to be the most fucked for my buck when I get stuck like this. I hate having to guess. And uh, it's hard when you cover another game on your main channel and you work full time to kind of cover all this stuff. But I'm going to do my best. I'm going to try to keep going and keeping the daily uploads for you guys. Because uh, you guys seem to be enjoying the content so far. I appreciate it. Please make sure you like and subscribe if you are enjoying it. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Have a good rest of your day. Peace.